Hey there film fans, today I'm going to talk to you about that one you've all been waiting for, Star Wars. This fighter pilot and his droid end up on a planet and... Okay, okay, okay Jedi's, I know you don't want any spoilers, so I'm not going to talk about the plot too much, don't worry. Let's face it though, if you're that big a fan, you must have seen it by now. I'm not a hardcore Star Wars fan, Warsy, whatever you call it, I don't know, but I have seen the original films as a child, and the prequels I think I saw one or two of in the cinema when they came out wasn't too fussed by as a teenager, so I'm not like a hardcore fan, but still obviously you have to find out what it's all about. What I feel seems to be the balancing act is they have to stay true to the original theme, but create something new, so without just being referential of old stuff. They can't just rely on what's gone before. It has to build on it and be fresh at the same time, which is quite hard to do, really. Mostly, I think they did a really good job as well. New characters-wise, I really liked the fighter pilot I mentioned, played by Oscar Isaacs. I thought he was really funny and had a good kind of look to him as well, that he had that old school yet modern classic thing going on. Obviously, it's great to have a more racially diverse cast, plus, Great to have an action female hero. My favourite was probably BB-8 though, great design on him, really funny considering he's not even got a face, that's quite impressive. However occasionally I did find the dynamics between, particularly between the old cast and the new cast could be a bit like the Doctor and his assistants and it did feel like it was catering more to a new childhood audience. Like it felt more of a child's film than I remember the others feeling. In places it reminded me a bit of Harry Potter. Visually it definitely looked a lot better than the prequels, it was much more immersive, um, it was much more physical and some of the settings were really beautiful. It, it was a good looking film. It was nice that some of the background alien characters, they kind of used old designs and were very reminiscent of the old movies too. I also liked the credit music was the same style as it used to be, so put you right back into that zone. The plot was interesting, but it was a bit frustrating. There's another bad guy come, you know, it's another force of evil, dark force, whatever you call it. Whatever happens before, whatever they do, it always ends up back at square one and they have to fight off another Death Star of evil baddies. Um, and so when you see the old cast and it's like, oh, you're having to deal with this again. Um, come on, it's Disney, where's their happily ever after? It, it had a kind of overwhelming sadness to it for me. But that might be my post-holiday lacrimosity syndrome going on. However, there was one plot point that turned me against the film. Um, I, I felt it wasn't appropriate, and it was a big one. So when it happened, and I'm trying not to say what it was, I did kind of go, no, 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 um, and then closed off a bit to watching the rest of the movie and enjoying it. Perhaps if I was to re-watch it, knowing that was coming, I might enjoy it more, but that did spoil it for me. It felt like they were taking like, I felt the decision was like, hey, we're making something new and better, we don't need to worry about what's happened before. I felt it was a bit cocky. Occasionally as well, I did feel like some of the scenes were set up to mimic previous iconic scenes. It's like, oh, check this out, do you remember that? Well, look, we're doing it again. Yeah, we see, you know. It would be nice if they were creating something new in those cases as opposed to just going, hey, remember that? However... It's interesting that a film that I didn't think I cared that much about did invoke quite a strong reaction. Um, so that means they must be doing something right. Also, my dad came along with me. He asked to come for his Christmas present. He really loved it. Um, he isn't a massive Star Wars fan either, but he has been a fan since they came out and he enjoyed it and if it makes my dad happy, that makes me happy to some extent. And my dad doesn't go to the cinema very often so he's not as spoilt as me with movies perhaps and he really enjoyed it so that counts as something for me and I'm really happy it made him happy. Hey, I know loads of people have really loved it so maybe it was just me with that thing. Anyway, what did you guys think about the big bad thing? Let me know in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hey, 2016 soon. See you guys there.